Something I'm doing more and more with my tours, especially with my new a la Campania experiences, is finding unique and fun activities to add to these itineraries. One we created for my recent postcard Puglia, Italy experience was a cooking class with a local chef. All right, let's do this. So here we are at the Aya in Puglia, Italy, and our resident chef Cosimo is about to give Hi. us a demonstration for making pasta. Ciao Cosimo. Hi. What do you have planned? Che che facciamo? Facciamo i cavatelli. Starting with Barilla Farina Tipo Zero and water, Cosimo slowly works the pasta dough, adding more water little by little until it's the right consistency. Under Cosimo's watchful eye, each of us has a chance to participate and learn how to knead the dough. Once the dough is just right, he covers it with some plastic film and lets it sit for about 20 minutes while he prepares the other ingredients for the dish. Then he cuts off small chunks and rolls them out into long strands so that he can cut them into smaller pieces that are then rolled off the back of a fork one by one by each of us to create the unique shape of cavatelli. Once all the dough has been transformed, he takes it outside and places it in the sun to dry. While that happens, he preheats a large pan, adding ample amounts of precious Puglian olive oil, slides a clove of garlic around the pan, adds a jar of strained anchovies and a large amount of turnip greens we just picked from his garden plus a number of fresh tomatoes. Uh, if only this was smell-o-vision. Smells very good. Sale. That's why your hands are swollen. This to acute better. Oh, I like that. Oh. E si lascia andare. Sente già il profumo? Oh, yeah. Got some garbanzo beans. Molto faccio. Yeah. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. A little steamer. If only you were here to smell this. This is so good and so easy. Letting it dry in the sun here, separating it, make sure you can see all the surface areas. You get it off? All right. Get off the flour. Uh huh. Okay, now it's time to put in the water. Stir it a little bit. Once the pasta is mostly done, he adds it to the other pan to infuse the flavors into the otherwise bland pasta, which again is just flour and water. So he took these little biscuits and crushed them up. And now I believe he's going to add them to that oil with a little sprig of garlic, maybe a thickener. It's a multi-grain biscuit. So he's adding those crumbs to the oil and one sprig of garlic. It's like breadcrumbs, the multi-grain breadcrumbs. 
Next, Cosimo plates the pasta and adds the breadcrumb mixture over the top to add a bit of crunch to the dish. So we just finished our cooking class here in Puglia and this is the finished product. Looks amazing. Mm -hmm. Smells fantastic. S seems like the simplest thing in the world, but I don't want to discount how much goes into this, but it's just beautiful. Let's try it. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have an interest in this kind of activity or so many others that we do on my trips, then be sure to visit the alacampagna.com website for more details and to get a free download. And do let us know in the comments if you've ever taken a cooking class yourself. While you're at it, please share this video with others who might be interested and give it a big thumbs up. And remember, drifters, life's too short not to travel.